Good morning. It is my great honor to report the result of simple trial on behalf of my study group at SAGES 2018, Seattle, USA. Um, single means, single stands for the single incision versus multiport laparoscope surgery for colon cancer multi-center prospective randomized trial in Korea. Uh, this simple study was funded by KSELS, the Korean Society of Endoscopic and Laparoscopic Surgery. As you know, since the first introduction of laparoscope surgery in the field of colorectal disease, the indication of laparoscope has extended from benign to malignant disease. But in the early period, of early day of laparoscope surgery for colorectal cancer, there has been a lot of concern about the safety. But during the past two decades, large-scale multi-center prospect randomized trial had reported better short-term surgical outcomes and acceptable long-term oncological outcomes of laparoscope surgery compared to uh, conventional open surgery. So as a result, at present, laparoscope surgery for colorectal cancer is considered not only an alternative surgical treatment, but also a better surgical option for the colorectal cancer practically. Furthermore, the surgical, stand, surgical procedure standardization and the large experience and advanced technology stimulate the sur surgeon to look for more advanced MIS, and as a consequence, the notes and the seals were introduced. But, you know, because of the practical and technical limitation of notes, the notes is not the best solution uh, at surgeon disposal. So instead, the single incision laparoscope surgery uh, became an attractive solution for the surgeon who are looking for more advanced MIS. The concept of single incision laparoscope surgery is very simple, like the name of our trial. Uh, single use of, it means the performing a surgery use a small incision and using the umbilicus as a small point of incision and using the umbilicus for the specimen is extraction and do not use additional cord at the abdomen. So the surgeon who use a single incision laparoscope surgery, surgery they use a only small single incision. They expected several advantages over the conventional multiport laparoscope surgery. The surgeon who use this technique expected much less post-operative pain, much faster post-operative recovery, much better cosmetic effect, much improved patient satisfaction. But um, on the other hand, Single incision laparoscope use, using a small, just small single incision is kind of catch-22 because all the challenges, including lack of triangle dissection, limited freedom of motion, collision between the surgical instrument, and ergonomic difficulty came from just using a small single incision. So until now, there are many concerns about the single incision laparoscope surgery, especially in terms of safety, such as surgical complication, technical feasibility, and oncological safety. What about evidence? Many reports try to, uh, imp uh, try to report the safety and efficacy of single incision laparoscope surgery for colorectal cancer. But the majority of the study is, came from single institute or single surgeon using a retrospective analysis. Even though there are several prospective randomized trial, the size is very small. Until now, the largest one is the randomized clinical trial of single incision versus multiport using 100 pa patients in each group. Because of the lack of strong evidence, many, many meta-analysis or system review conclude that single incision uh, laparoscope colon, colon cancer surgery should be still considered as an experimental procedure, and there are insufficient evidence to recommend widespread use of single incision laparoscope surgery instead of laparoscope colorectal cancer surgery. So until now, the single incision laparoscope surgery for colorectal cancer have very limited evidence and still need a large scale multicenter randomized control trial as needed. So I proudly introduce our simple trial, the result of simple trial, single incision versus multiport laparoscopic surgery for colon cancer multicenter prospective randomized trial in Korea. The aim of this simple trial is to identify the short-term perioperative outcomes and long-term survival of a single port laparoscope surgery compared with multi-port laparoscope surgery in colon cancer. This study was registered at clinicaltrial.gov. Seven university hospitals in South Korea participate in this trial, and the patient with the pathological confirmed adenocarcinoma was eligible for this trial. 
We exclude rectal cancer, transverse colon cancer, and descending colon cancer, and emergency operations such as obstruction or perforation was also excluded. The distance metastasis and T4B cancer was excluded in this trial. The patient was registered and randomized using with an E-based program like this. We designed this trial as a non impurity test. We, the sample size was calculated assuming 10% difference in post-operative complication 80 per, with 80% power, 95% two-sided confidential level, and 10% drawbout. So uh, as a result, 198 patients are required on each group. The primary endpoint of this trial is 30-day post-operative complication. Secondary endpoint or number of harvest lymph node, length of colony resection margin, time to functional recovery, three years disease-free survival and overall survival, and quality of life and patient satisfaction rate. We define the complication in detail like this. The study was started in August 2011, and the last patient was enrolled July last year. A total 388 patients were enrolled in this trial. This is consult of diagram, diagram of consult. Uh, actually, initially 571 patients was eligible for this trial, and eight, 388 patients was randomized into two groups. Finally, 179% in SEALs and 180% in MPRS group were analysis in this trial. This is the result. In basic demographics, there was no difference between the groups. The mean, mean BMI was 24.3, and history of previous abdominal surgery was 20% in SEALs and 23% in MPRS group, showed no difference. In tumor characteristics, the tumor size was 3.8 in SEALs and 3.7 centimeter in MPRS, showed no difference. And pathologic T stage and pathologic N stage, there was, the, there was no significant difference was observed. In, operation, in, in terms of operation time, the operation time was 175 minutes in SEALS group and 164 minutes in MPRS group, but showed no difference. The estimate blood loss, there was no differences. The, there was no open conversion in MPRS group, but 25 cases, which is 14% of single incisional laparoscopic group needed additional support to complete the surgery, and three cases in SEALS group need to convert to open surgery. Surgeon uh, prepared the umbricus for the specimen extraction site at SEALS group. The total length, the length of total incision was much shorter in SEALS group, 4.6 centimeter versus 7.2 centimeter, but the length of specimen extraction site showed no difference, 4.4 centimeter in SEALS, 4.6 centimeter in MPRS. This is the result of pathology outcome. There showed no different number of harvest lymph nodes and length of proximal resection margin and length of distal resection margin. There was no significant differences were observed. Time to pass the plateaus and the time to start the diet after surgery showed no difference. And the post-operative hospital stay was seven days in SEALS group and 7.4 days in MPRS group. The post-operative complication, which is the primary endpoint of this trial, the overall complication rate was 10%, 10.6% in SEALS group, and 13.9% MPRS group. We used the Calabian Dindu classification. The grade 3A was one case in SEALS, and 3B was two cases in SEALS. And 3A in, in MPRS is four, and 3B in MPRS was four. It showed no differences. We estimate the pain until the discharge or the post-operative day seven at both resting state and the coughing state. In terms of pain, we cannot find any significant difference between the single incision laparoscope surgery group versus a multi-port laparoscope surgery groups. And also in terms of amount of PCA consumption, we did not find any difference between the single incision group versus multi-port laparoscope surgery group. Chairman, ladies, gentlemen, there are my conclusion. The short-term perioperative outcomes of single incision laparoscope surgery, including 30 days post-operative complication, were similar to those of multi-port laparoscope surgery. Single incision laparoscope surgery for colon cancer is safe and technically feasible. 
and single incision laparoscopic surgery could be considered as a surgical option for colon cancer. 감사합니다. Thank you very much.